it's Muriel. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. I got a really big, big haul video for you guys today. I'm really excited. I just want to turn around show and you. just <laughs> show you guys one. Um, so these is two big bags of stuff that came from the Goodwill outlet, and I also have a bag of shoes over there. So hope I'm not making you guys dizzy. And that little chica in the background, that's Sasha. She's also on my video today to make a guest appearance. <laughs> so I just, um, I photographed with her for eBay. Um, I used her in some of my listings. So she just wanted to make a little guest appearance on my video today. So let's get started, guys. So again, this is 80 pounds. All this stuff came from the Goodwill outlet. I have some, um, this is mostly women's clothing that I'm going to do now. I'm going to do another video later with my husband and that's going to be men's clothing. So feel free to come back later and check my other video out. I'm not sure when these are going to upload, probably tomorrow. Okay, so let's get started with this stuff. All right, let's get started. Hope you guys are doing great, by the way. Hope everybody's doing good. Hope you're having a good week so far. First item up so is this Beautiful Ann Taylor Loft. This is just a really cute top. They like a little cardigan. Okay, but in front. All right. And I'm gonna try to go really fast, guys, because I got a lot of stuff. This is a size small. Okay. Next item is um, a cute little blouse. This is by Moa. I don't know Moa. if anybody knows anything about this. I don't know if that's like a boutique brand or something, but it's Moa Moa. And I picked it up really guys, because I like these really cute bell sleeves. Really nice print. So pretty. Tunic really blouse. And this is size small. Let me just move this back a little bit guys. All right, okay, better. We're good now. Okay, I picked this up. This is Chico's. Now, I just saw this laying in the bins. Um, this is a, it's called an oblong scarf. <laughs> I've never really seen one of these. Um, but it was new with tags, and I just saw it laying really cute in the, in the bins. And it retails for $39. Okay. And it's a long oblong scarf. So I guess you could just wear this over a nice dress or something or a nice really dressy shell or something. I'm not, guys, I'm not even sure how you would wear something like this, <laughs> but I just wanted to pick it up. It was new attacks and it's really beautiful. So that's why I got it, okay? All right, next piece here. This is Rue 21. This is a size 1X. And I do have plus sizes in here, guys, and just regular standard sizes too in this in this haul. So this is just a really cute tunic blouse, Route 21, size 1X. And I love the detail across the neckline. I love the little sleeves there. It's really cute. So I just wanted to pick it up. Okay, next piece. I told you guys I'm gonna move fast today. This is Cabbie. This is a Cabbie shirt. Um, I would say this is more so a tunic, and this is a size small, and it has this those really nice um, ruched sides. So it sort of like goes in on the sides, and it's really cute burgundy color. Okay, these are all really um, basic pieces that I'm showing you guys. However, there are a few gems here. So let me show you guys the first one. So there are a few cool finds that I stumbled across. All right, so this is by Joie. And I, I look at a lot of resellers. I love watching resellers on YouTube. I subscribe to so many <laughs> resellers. And I watch so many videos. So I do know um, Joie is a brand that a lot of resellers sell. So I decided to pick it up. And also, I like the fact that this is cashmere. It's just a cashmere turtleneck. Okay, so um, I am definitely going to take a fabric shaver to this, guys. Because as you see, it's a little, some pilling there. So I'm definitely going to take a fabric shaver. But just a cute little brown. Cashmere. Cashmere. turtleneck by Joie 
and let me just show you guys the tag here. Now I usually can cashmere. tell when something is cashmere right away. Okay, but that is, that's it. So, cashmere turtleneck. So that was cool. I didn't even know it was, I didn't know what draw was, guys, until I, you know, it's important if you're starting out selling, <laughs> watch a lot of resellers on YouTube, especially the really popular people who's been doing this for um, a couple years or more. Um, you know, they know what they're doing. You can trust them. So um, if it wasn't for me watching their videos, I wouldn't even know what a draw was. I have no clue. But I picked that up because I liked it because it was cashmere. I'm like, oh, this is a cashmere turtleneck. And then I noticed it said draw. I'm like, okay, let me get that. All right, next piece. Tommy Hill figure extra small. Just a striped little sweater. Okay, Tommy Hill figure. And yes, guys, I know there's a lot of extra smalls and smalls that I got. <laughs> I don't try to do that on purpose. It's just that, you know, you go to the outlet and you get what you can find, right? So I just pick it up. Um, I spent like probably $69 for these two huge bags of clothing. And with the shoes, too. The shoes included. So everything was $69. Okay. Next piece. Um, this is Exhilaration, you know, this is a Walmart brand. It's just a nice pullover, open knit little blouse, short sleeve. This is really cute, it would be nice for the spring or, you know, summer maybe. So, so I want to get that. All right, let me see. Now this is um, J. Kincaid. I could have sworn I saw somebody talking about this before on on YouTube, but I'm not sure. I don't know. I think this is a Nordstrom brand. It might be of um, anthropology. I'm not. I'm not 100% sure, but I know. Um, I looked at the comms, and some people had it listed as Nordstrom. Some people had had it listed as anthropology. So not sure, but I just picked it up because I love the. I love this cute little bow. You know, print. you know, I'm all about these funky colors and cool shapes and <laughs> geometric prints and stuff like that. Yeah. So, so that's why. But this is really cute, right? And this is a size small, by the way. Okay. Next piece. All right. This is Charlotte Russe. Just a cute little short sleeve blouse, tunic blouse. Little V neck. Not sure. Or would that be a white neck? But um, Charlotte Russe, short sleeve, cute little sleeves, nice embroidery. I got a lot of Charlotte Russe also in this in this batch of stuff. Okay, got some men's stuff. I'm not gonna show you guys the men's stuff now. I'm kind of excited about the men's stuff, so please come back to see the next video, guys, with my hubby. All right, this is an express, uh, just an express short sleeve. I believe this is a crop top, guys. This is really short. I'm like 5'8", and I held this up to me, and it really was short on me. It came like up, you know, my stomach. I don't know, it looks cropped to me. So it's like a little crop, short sleeve top. Um, being an express, size small. It stretches, it has cotton and spandex inside of it. My friend again. I'm probably making y'all dizzy when I just switch this stuff back and forth. I know you're like, just show us just one side. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm still new to this this old YouTube filmmaking business, so you gotta excuse me if I seem all um, awkward on camera. I am awkward because I'm new to this, so <laughs> maybe in a year or so I'll be a pro at this. So <laughs> this is a um, this is just a cute little tunic. A gap tunic this is a size small. okay and um, it has this cute call neck okay so I just got that I like the neck if it didn't have a cow neck. neck I probably wouldn't even get it because it's just kind of basic but I like necks like this necklines like that so yeah okay next piece this is an App Studio, not a big major brand or anything so, like that, but App Studio. And this is just a cute lined 
layered short sleeve shirt, blouse. Okay, it's really pretty though. Summer. Really, really nice. Look at the neckline. It's really cute, right? Okay, and I, I say it's layered because it has this like nice lining here. My cats are fighting. Oh, not good, not good. I hear them fighting in there. Okay. All right. <laughs> So, uh, okay, this is a Charlotte Ruse. I told you guys I had a lot of Charlotte Ruse. So this is another um, Charlotte Ruse dress. However, I see a flaw in it that I didn't really, I didn't catch this flaw before, but this is broken. That's not good. So I'm probably not gonna sell that because, I mean, I could sell it and just play as a flaw, like, oh, broken embellishment. I don't know. I might, I might not. I don't really like to sell things with flaws. But it is a cute dress anyway. I'll just show you guys anyway. I might just be donating a sucker. But um, it's it's really cute. I don't know. You guys probably can't even see the front of it. But it's one of those high lows. So you guys can't see it. But it's it comes up in the front and it's longer in the back. But you know, doesn't, I, I probably won't sell it because that broken embellishment there. So, I don't know. We'll see. I'll think about it. I, I don't know how that broke or I didn't notice that before. We got another dress. Oh yeah, White House Black Market. This is a size 4. So, yes, there is a little white spot on there. I'm going to clean that off. Because this just, you know what, this dress can only be dry cleaned. So I can't wash it. So I'm going to have to just see if I can get that spot off by wiping it down. But just a cute little cocktail pleated dress. Okay, probably goes um, to your knee. Okay. And it is 100% um, polyester. Yeah, and it zips down in the back. Size four again, the back. This is a really cute dress though, right? I mean, Cut off. if I can clean it, it probably would do good. I love White House Black Market. Really cute. Time. Okay, another dress, guys. Um, as you wish, I don't know much about this brand. Just picked it up because I thought the dress was really lovely. English dress. It's lined as well. That's how it looks in the back. Size small. Yeah. So. That one's cute. So next piece here. This is a Vintage America tunic blouse, size extra um, extra large. Vintage America. I don't know much about that brand either, but I thought this was like interesting looking. Okay. Big, big extra large still. I mean, this is a really big extra large. This really looks more like a plus size, like a 3X or something. But it's cute. I can probably list this as, I don't know. Well, when I measure it for sure, it's like for a, sure. It's a big extra large. All right, here is a Pleone, which is a nice little short sleeve Pleone, which is a Nordstrom brand. Pleone. Short sleeve little blouse. Okay, in good condition. It's really cute. Nice for the springtime. Okay. Um, this is just a charter club piece, size large, 100% Pima cotton, short sleeve little shirt. It has really pretty print on there. Now I like the print. I don't know much about this. Um, I just got it because it looked interesting. Connie's Moonlight. Okay. And it's kind of interesting, interesting little open little cardigan guy. <laughs> I think it's cute. I mean, I like it. 
I think somebody would really like this. It's really beautiful. It has pretty colors to it. It's a size medium. I like it. So I believe somebody else might like it. All right. This is an express piece. Um, I'm not sure if this is men or women's. This is a size small, but I gotta ask my husband. I don't, <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know, but it doesn't look like a woman's top. It's express, size small, but it just looks kinda, it's kinda small to be a man's small. I wanna ask my husband, he'll know for sure. So, <laughs> I got this one. Not sure if it's a man's or a woman's, but I'm gonna figure it out before I want to figure it out before I list it. How about that? But but yeah, it, it's kind of interesting. It's cute, you know, loyalty, temperance, it, uh, temperance, love. It has some cute words on the front of it. That nice military green um, color. I really think it's a man's, but I'm not sure, so. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to ask my husband. He'll tell me. All right. <laughs> Moving on. So this is, I believe, a jam collection. Yes. Jam collection tunic blouse. This is a size 3X. Okay. 3X. Really cute floral um, tunic blouse. Deep spread this really well for me, guys. Jam collection. Because, you know, I love their stuff because... They have these really pretty colors and like like flowers and stuff like that. A lot of floral prints that they have on their clothing. And um, they have a lot of these cool tunics and they're really dressy, really nice things you can wear to work. So I love the JM collection. And I, I usually get decent, you know, maybe $10 to $15 for one of those. So not bad. Um, let me see, man, stuff, I'm not going to show you guys that now. Um, this is just a basic crop and barrel stretch, um, size large. This is another brand that uh, a lot of readers still don't talk about, but this brand does really okay for me. Like, like okay, maybe seven to ten bucks on this, but, um, this one is really cute because it has these cute, um, sequins and embellishments across the neckline so it's really cute okay we're almost done with this bag all right this is this is banana republic banana republic um just a turtleneck size large burgundy burgundy turtleneck i have this skirt also i'm gonna show you guys um blank new york blank nyc this is a really cute little skirt. Really small size, but it's cute. So I got this cute little jean white skirt. And it's new with tags as well. Okay. And I believe it retails for $58. Blank NYC. Okay. Banana Republic. I really like this one. This is a Banana Republic tunic. So, like a little blouse, tunic blouse. This is like, and it's really cute. Have this nice material here, like a sweater type of material, and then it's like sheer arms. That's why I got that. And Banana Republic is a good brand. Size large. That's really pretty. The Charlotte Roots piece. Okay, so this is like a, I would say this is more so a, like, this is an open, like a draped, lagging, lagging look, draped cardigan, duster, in a sense. It has a hood there. See how it has this more so asymmetrical hem. So it's definitely a lagging look. So it's really nice. Okay, let me grab the other bag and show you guys. Another bag. <laughs> it was tough to get through. 
So let's get through that. So let me just make some space here. All right. <sighs> Another big mama is coming All right. through. Let's get started with this one. Okay. I don't even know where to start, guys. This is crazy. All right, so these dress pants, actually, I don't know if I'm gonna sell these. To be honest, I just brought these from my mannequin. I'm gonna dress her with these. So when I um, wanna photograph dressy items, I'm gonna put these on her, like more career pieces. So these are for my mannequin. I'm not selling those, so. Um, also got these for the mannequin, but I might sell these also. But these are some cute little um, career stretch Izod pants. And Izod, 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 <laughs> size two. Okay, um, they're her size actually, so that's why I got these. I think she will look cute in these, just to style her. Okay, and um, but I might sell. I might actually sell these actually, because these are nice. I like the nice plaid iron. All right. What do we have, guys? Oh, Ann Taylor dress. Okay, so this is a really nice Ann Taylor, uh, I would say like a nice little cocktail dress. This is sleeveless. Sleeveless little cocktail dress. And, okay, just wanted to make sure I was showing you guys the right size. <laughs> I was trying to figure out what's the front and what's the back, but this is a size 14. Nice size, it is lined. And it zips down in the back. So, bow in the back is really too, cute. right? So, that's cute. Nice little dress. Probably goes a little bit past the knee, maybe. Depending on how tall you are. But, but yeah, really cute. And Taylor sleeveless little dress. Okay. Sportswear petite. This is a uh, meet, um, petite medium, <laughs> petite medium, chunky, I would say a chunky knit sweater. It zips down in the front. Not the best size, I know, but these do still sell. Petites still are okay to get, sell. depending on the style and everything. But this is such a cute sweater. I really liked it. I like the color. I love it. So I'm like, I think somebody will really like this. I don't know much about Casper brand. But I just love this style. So I'm like, I, I had to get it. That's how it looks. Okay. All right, moving on. Let me see here. Tell bits. And this is a, another petite, but I couldn't pass it up because I love tell bits. So this is a medium petite though. Just another chunky cable knit sweater. And it really, um, it's really cute because it has this cute down zipper. So it just zips down in the back. Okay. So it's more okay. sweaters, looks like, in this in this bag. Okay. Priya. I don't know much about Priya, but I love this sweater. Another cable knit sweater. Priya. That me. That would look so cute on my mannequin. <laughs> and it, it has this really cute little, it's this cute mock neck that I like with this little button here. So yeah. Another sweater. All right, um, Charlotte Roos, size small. This is, looks like this might be more of a off the shoulder type of sweater, pullover sweater. Not the shoulder is really trending now, so. Oh yeah. This is New York and Company. Just a nice open knit pullover, pullover top. This is really pretty. I love the lime green oh color. <laughs> Good for the springtime, size small. All right. Okay, 
another sweater. This is by Gap. V-neck sweater. Really pretty print. Size medium. Okay, chaps. Chaps is a pretty decent brand for me. Um, this is a extra small. This is just a sheer pullover on top. Okay. This is really like oversized. <laughs> Extra small is really obviously oversized. Okay, but this is really pretty. I love the print. I love the really bright and really vivid colors. Really cute. Another okay. Banana Republic piece. This is just a cardigan, button down cardigan. Really cute floral print. Okay. Size small. Got a lot of smalls here. Okay, here go a Talbots piece. This is an extra large floral print Talbots piece. Really cute for the springtime. These floral print, um, these floral print tops, they be gone, y'all. They really be selling. A lot of people <laughs> like flowers. So, yeah. Okay, this is a, just a dress barn sweater. Uh, V-neck sweater, extra large, basic, nothing really too fancy about this. Yep. All right, and... This crazy looking top, <laughs> this is Beldini. Beldini, do you guys know anything about Beldini? I don't know much about Beldini, but I thought this was really interesting. It's red, which is one of my favorite colors, and then this animal print, and then these cute little embellishments and the zipper down, so cute. I really like this. <laughs> so It looks really like vintage, but I like it, it's cute. I know it will sell. It's a size large again. Beldini. So, yeah. That size six. Just a sleeveless wrap, crossover wrap blouse. Okay. Pretty colors. Pretty for the summertime. Okay. Nice. This is a dress. This is. Let me see, what is, what, what is the name? Sorry guys, I'm trying to figure this out here. It's rocket science. It is like, <laughs> this is like rocket science to me. Okay, um, Hollister. <laughs> this is Hollister. And this is, this is new attack. So it looks like it was selling for $39.95. It's a cute dress, right? So just a short sleeve shift dress. I guess this is a shift dress. Yeah. Isn't that pretty? Isn't that print pretty, guys? Cute, right? Okay, and you know, I would say uh, it probably goes a little bit above your knee, depending on how tall you are, though. And it crosses over in the back. Isn't that cute? And what size is this? Let me see. It says size hmm, large. It's the size large. So, size large. So, yeah. Bro, I really like this. I don't pick up a lot of Hollister pieces, but this was beautiful. And it's new with tags. So, you can't really beat that, right? Can't beat something that's new with tags. And it looks nice. So, get it, pick it up, sell it. Can't beat it. All right. This isn't just an old navy dress, so a little cute old navy dress. This is a size medium. Okay. So that's a cute little green short sleeve old navy dress. Yeah, really nice for the springtime. Has some cute little embroidery on the sides there, on the sides of the arm. Stretches in the waist. Cute. Okay. 
Okay. What else do we have? Oh, another dress, guys. I have a lot of dresses. I got this stuff a few days ago, so it's like, I'm looking at this like, wow, everything is like a surprise to me because it's been a couple of days <laughs> since I've looked in this. So sorry if it's like, it seems like this is the first time I'm looking in here. But um, this is just a nice little midi Ashley Stewart dress. Ashley Stewart. Size 16, sorry. Size 16. Ashley Stewart sleeveless little pretty dress. Very sexy. And it goes, um, it's not maxi, it goes down um, probably mid calf. Uh, or, or almost like probably past your calf, almost to your ankle maybe. So. It's really pretty. I love it. Really cute. Wouldn't this be really cute for the summer, guys? Look at those colors. Pretty, right? Look at that pretty print. So that's cute. Very sexy. Definitely good for the beach or something. All right, if I'm like really so close in the camera, guys, I'm trying to bend down and get this stuff out of this bag. I have so much stuff. Okay, this is another crossover wrap dress. Uh, mix it, uh, small. Have you guys heard of mix it? Anybody heard of that? If you guys, um, you know, I'm going through all this stuff and if you guys know some of these brands and I'm showing, let me know in the comments what you, you know, let me go in the comments what you guys think about it. Do you sell these things? Just let me know in the comments if you guys sell anything um, like this or what brands do you guys sell? So I would love to get some feedback from my viewers. Definitely would love that. So this is really cute, sexy little dress, right guys? Floral, nice for the springtime. Really cute. Pretty, right? That's a pretty color. Okay, pretty press. I'm sorry, this is a h and skirt. And this is a size 10, okay? So um, it's just a nice little lined pencil. And it has this little um, belt here. I guess this would be like, yeah, you can wrap this around like a little cute belt. So really nice. And it zips down on the side here. Pretty. So this is a sleeveless, just a sleeveless Chico shell. This is a size three, which is an extra large in um, Chico's um, an extra large and standard sizing, size three. And this is just really cute, fun, little floral sleeveless shell. A kind in spandex mix, so it does stretch. I love these little fun prints. <laughs> I love it. I can't fit a size three though, <laughs> but in Jacob's, it's a little too small for me, but um, these are so cute. This is another one, um, another size three, maybe the same person donated these. So another sleeveless shell. I like the other print better though. And this is 100% cotton, so this one does not stretch. Okay, nice for the summertime. Just a yellow cute cardigan. This is Lance in size extra small, two, four. Bam, okay. So, buttons down in the front. Pretty yellow, pretty for the springtime. Lance in it, it does well for me also. I know, I believe that's so that Sears. All right guys, we're almost down to the end of this bag. <laughs> um, Pink Rose, I've heard of this. I've seen some resellers talk about this, but I don't know if this is Nordstrom or Anthropology, I'm not sure how to do more research, but I do remember this. Pink rose, so it's one of those. Um, and it's just an open knit pullover top. And it has some pilling in there, so I have to use the fabric shaver, but it's really cute. Okay. Back. Basic top, nothing fancy about that one either at all. I don't know if you, it's um, a picture of a butterfly, like that's all I know. 
So if you guys know what this is, let me know. Cause I don't know. I need help. <laughs> um, so I don't know, but it's a cute button down, button front blouse. So I love the colors, white and blue flowers, three, four sleeves. And I just know it has a picture of a butterfly and the tag. And I don't know what is that. So I, I have to do some research on that. If you guys know, if anyone knows, please leave the comment in the comment area. <laughs> and I would really appreciate that, guys. Thank you. All right, moving on. So this is just a no boundaries. This is a Walmart brand. But I love this cute little boho print this is so pretty and I love the this cute little embroidery okay open embroidery here it's so pretty isn't that cute I love this stuff and it is sheer you have to definitely wear something obviously under that if you want to if you don't want to then you don't have to but most people wear something under it <laughs> And it just ties also in the front. Forgive me, y'all. I'm acting like a goof today. Um, I'm a little goofy today. All right. <laughs> Next piece. This is a Catherine's V-neck top. This is a size 3X, 26, 28 wide. Just a cute little Catherine's um, short sleeve tunic top. Really nice. Purple and white. Cute print. Very nice. Very nice. I love Catherine's Liz and Me, Catherine's Ashley Stewart, Lane Bryant. I love those plus size brands. Those are really great to find and sell. All right, this is Ann Taylor Law, size small. Okay, just a cute little pink and black polka dot, but in front blouse. Thank you for the springtime. Pink is so cute. Okay. All right. Moving on. We got some fun animal prints coming up, guys. Y'all know how I love my animal prints. So, <laughs> this is a really cute animal printed, like, blouse. Um, sheer. Um, it's more of a tunic. This is a high low. I want you guys to see that you see how it goes up in the front and hangs down in the back and um animal print and it has this cute little print at the bottom a little different print there really funky cool top extra small so many nice extra small stuff my goodness i wish i was extra small sometimes <laughs> you extra small people out there you guys are so lucky seriously they make so many cute things in small sizes. Where they're, they're, you know, nowadays the plus size is getting better because back then, years ago, plus size stuff was not looking that cute. I used to hate it, like, seriously. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so it's really cute. I love that top. Um, okay, another Route 21. Probably it's the same person donating. I don't know. Probably not. It's a size medium. Probably not the same person who donated the other one, but it's medium. All right. And this is just a, uh, this is like a really nice blouse. Sheer. Need to wear something under that. Really pretty floral. This is, this is not high low. Is that high low? Yeah, this is sort of a, this is a high low blouse also. So yeah, it's really cute. Okay. I don't really, um, I think I've sold some Route 21 before in the past. I'm not sure, um, probably a few times. I don't know much about the brand. I don't know if it's a fast mover or not. We'll see. So, so yeah. Um, this is Iris Basic. And I don't know about this brand. just picked it up because it was cute. So guys in the comments, if anyone knows Iris Basic, if you've sold this brand before, let me know. How is it? Is it good? Is it hot? Is it not? What do you think? Let me know. Um, but just as another little cute high-low, like sleeveless, um, lacy little blouse. So 
cute. All right. And this one is a Dina B. Dina B. I don't know about Dina B either, but it's cute. <laughs> it's a size medium. And just a nice little top. I got this because I love the embroidery here on the sleeves. It's just bun in front and it has a little tie down as well. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. I'm so sorry about that. Sneeze. Allergies. Um, okay. All right, uh, let's see. This is just a dress barn, size large. Short sleeve, little tunic blouse. This is really cute. Pretty purple. That's nice. All right, let's see. Kato. All right, so this is a Kato. Size 1820 wide. And this is oh, a little cute tunic. And I like the, you know, the little embroidered um, bottom there. Well, more embroidered bottom. That's really cute. It would have been cute if they put some embroidery around the neckline too, but but that's cute. That's why I got it. And I like the colors too. Pretty. All right. Okay. Let's see. This is Kathy Daniels. Um, yeah, just like it because of the print. It's really cute. Just one of those layered, um, nice little tops, and it has this cute floral print. I really like that. And this is a size large. Okay, Max Studio. Sorry guys, I'm just looking to see like what size is this. <laughs> um, okay, so this is a Max Studio, um, uh, like a butt in the front, like blazer jacket. And it's lined and this is a size six. Okay. It's cute, this is pretty, really cute. Look at the back. I like the um, this part in the back. It's cute. And these little cute pockets in the front. Looks like they got something in the pocket, y'all. I'm nosy. Let me see what the people left in the pocket. Okay, what is there? I don't know. I have no clue. Is this a receipt or something? Oh, maybe it could be some money in there, you know? You never know. People could have left some money in their pockets, so I'd be looking. So, <laughs> I could use the extra cash. So, <laughs> forgive me, I'm, I'm a fool today. Um, I'm a fool today. <laughs> All right, guys. Here we go. Um, next piece. This is Old Navy. Um, what is this extra small extra it looks like it's an extra small it is uh, not sure guys I can't see it that well and then it says TP and then XP all right so so yeah Old Navy um, top <laughs> um, yeah so this is cute and it stretches, so I know they have some spandex in there. It's really, really nice. Very stretchy. I like these buttons in the shoulders. They're cute. All right. All right. Let's see what. Okay, Express. Oh, an Express piece. Just a um, nice little, like, um, nice little top, um, dolman, sort of like the, sort of like, um, dolman sleeves in a way. Yeah. 
Express. Express always does really well for me. But it's the size large again. It's the back. Okay. See what we have next. Okay, so this is just a St. John's Bay. Um, I believe it's still at Walmart. I don't really pick this up that much, but it was a 1X. And I like the print on there. So got some flowers, got some stripes in there. Cute colors for the springtime. So that's why I got it. And let me see this one. This is another Walmart brand, Beta Glory, size 12, 14. Just a cute little tunic. Really basic brand. All right. Let's see. Rose and Olive. I've heard about this one. Rose and Olive. I think this is a, a decent um, brand. Okay. And this is just a blouse. If I can get it together and show you guys. Just a black basic blah. blah. <laughs> it's really to kind of, you know, like um, basic, you know, like not much, you know, not just basic black, basic black top. I don't really, I really don't like it, but, um, um, I believe somebody might like it. It's a lot of people who like basic um, tops and stuff. So, yeah. And let me see here. This is just a dress barn piece. Just a like floral embellished top. Dress barn size large. Pretty. Allergies are kicking my butt. All right. Um, this is a 7th Avenue Design Studio, New York and Company. <laughs> Sleeveless blouse. This is a size large. Okay. So this is really pretty. I like this sort of tiered effect that it has in the front. It's pretty, right? This is the back. All right, and let me see here. Um, what are you? August Silk. I believe this is sold at Ross. I saw this at Ross before. So, August Silk. And I get their cardigans sometimes. They do well. I don't get that much for them. Um, you know, $10 or less, but it's something. They're really lightweight. It didn't cost me that much, so. They have some cute cardigans. All right. Okay. It looks like we're done, guys, with that. Um, those two bags of clothing. So I'm done with the clothing. So now I want to show you guys the shoes. Uh, let me get to the shoes. Okay. Let me show you guys the shoes. Okay. So back with the shoes, guys. Back with the shoes. Okay, so again, this huge bag of shoes. shoes. It came from the, also came from the Goodwill outlet. I don't go to the regular Goodwill, guys. Um, well, I haven't been in a couple months because I can't afford it, unfortunately. Money's kind of funny. Not really. Money is non existent for me right now. So <laughs> that's not a funny thing. Uh, not having no money is not funny. So I would say it's non existent. That would be an honest thing to say. I know TMI, but that's the truth. So that's why I don't go to the um, Goodwill. You know, I just can't afford it at the moment. So I just go wherever I can to get the cheapest stuff possible. And yeah. <laughs> so let me show you guys the shoes. Now, the shoes at my Goodwill outlet is um, $3 a pair. So I picked these shoes up. Now, I don't really sell shoes. I've never sold shoes before, guys, but I'm trying to diversify my store with selling men's clothes and 
more different things like I'm trying to sell jeans now and pants even though I didn't really get a lot of pants in this haul or anything like that but I'm gonna start introducing that more men's stuff and shoes so um, here go the first pair of shoes so this is White House black market and these are just some cute little like um, really cute summery shoes summery heels great for the summertime okay sandals and um, these are size nine and a half medium so the bottom here you know you see all this crazy nonsense this is why I don't like to sell shoes because I think they're really like obviously they're he kind of gross I do throw these in the washer I don't know if people wash shoes I mean you guys who sell shoes please provide some type of insight to me as to what do you guys do when you get shoes from the outlet or bins or whatever or or the Goodwill store do you guys throw them in a the washer because I'm gonna throw these in a the washer I'm gonna put it on low and just throw it in there because I, I think wash wiping is just one not doing any justice it's a lot of grossness okay so I'm not doing that um, and then this is the bottom okay look at all this you know wear and all that so I don't like that so obviously when I list this I have to include you know just take pictures of this just show people okay it's a lot of wear on the bottom but this is still good you know you could still you know wear these they don't look bad the heel is not bad you know so uh, not bad and then the inside right the inside looks decent so I'm gonna take pictures of all of that and um, what the main thing about it is the shoe looks like it's in really good condition it's just I don't like this side you know I don't like this side here I don't like how it looks this is why I don't want to really sell shoes because I feel it's a lot of work but um, upper leather yeah nine and a half medium this is actually my size but these heels y'all I cannot do it I can't do it y'all women who could walk in these heels I don't know how y'all do it cuz I swear I'd be ready to fall over like in <laughs> I'm sick I'm so serious so <laughs> so yeah but these are really pretty and it's nothing wrong you know nothing wrong with it it's the other one and pretty color it's just this bottom this one looks bad too obviously so, you know, I don't like that. Um, you know, I'm putting it in a washer on low, low setting. I don't think that's bad, right? I don't really know. Yeah, I just feel like taking the rag and just wiping it off is not good enough. Because people have their feet in there and stuff. But anyway, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get too much into that. But <laughs> I just, yeah. Okay, and I got these actually. Say, I picked these up before and I put these in a washer and they're fine so these actually went in a washer and they came out with no problems they were on low setting so these actually got these couple maybe about a month or so ago these are Lauren Conrad's Lauren Conrad and they're really cute look at these these are so gorgeous and what size is this size seven and a half medium so this is a size seven and a half medium and then the bottoms look really good see I like that this bottom is not bad looking it's not all beat up and scuffed up and looking crazy the heel looks pretty good the inside looks decent so you know I think this is good and I, I look again like I said I put in a washer it came out and it's it looks fine I just don't really want to wipe these shoes down I don't feel it's really cleaning them properly and this is the other one so so yeah and these also came from the uh, everything I get they come from it, it everything comes from the good outlet so <laughs> everything comes from the outlet when it comes from another source I'll definitely let you guys know that okay all right this video has been really long guys all right let me um, show you guys the next pair of shoes all right this is a nine west so these are a pair of nine west it's white nine west shoes here peep toes peep toe heels okay these are in um, okay condition they are okay they look really cute on the outside but let me show you um, the flaws 
so the back again is looking like this I don't like that so I just have to take some good pictures but the heel looks good so that's the most important thing right it's pretty nice heels not all beat up and crazy looking this is a size 10 medium that's just this part that looks crazy and this is the inside of it not anyway, so and the comps on these shoes were all good you know hopefully I can get at least 20 bucks for oh, maybe 20 bucks on most of these or 15 to 20 bucks would be nice I spent three dollars so it's not that so we'll see I'm not sure so but yeah nice nice nine wash shoes let's see yeah. oh I left another pair of shoes in the laundry room I want to show you guys this is a gross pair guys though this is a gross pair <laughs> They look cute on the outside, but I gotta show you at the bottom. So this, this is guess, right? Really guess, really cute guess on stiletto shoes, and they they look really good, right? You know, on the outside, nice, pretty little metallic black little shimmery shoe. Now I'm gonna flip it over and show y'all the problem. Bam! Cat hair, disgusting. Sorry if that was extremely gross, but I did warn you guys. That's nasty, right? So, I, and this is another other one. I would not be wiping that off. It's going to wash her. And this is a size, I don't know what's, oh goodness, y'all. I don't know what size this is. Oh my gosh, they don't have a size on this shoe. What happened to it? I don't know what size this shoe is, guys. I feel, it looks like I can fit it. Let me see if I can fit this shoe. Oh, these, oh, actually, let me see. Guys, I have no, sh I don't know what size this is. Let me just put my big feet in there and see if I can fit it. If I can't fit it, then I don't know. This is not going to be good. <laughs> I don't know what size it is. Okay, I can't fit this shoe, so I'm not sure. I'm trying to, like, fit my, my fat shoe, my fat foot in there. Okay. Well, <laughs> I'm thinking it's a size 7 or, wait, oh, I found the size, guys. <laughs> I was right. I was right. 7.5 medium. I knew it was a 7 because I'm like a size 9.5 and, and my, like, heel is hanging out. So, so, yeah. But they're cute. Once I wash them, they will be fine, but they need to be washed. But this whole, you know, this is all nice. The outside, the heel looks good. It's just nasty, disgusting cat hair. So it's really gross. But, but we'll fix it up. All right. I got another pair in the laundry room. I got to run in there and show you guys. Also, I don't want to leave you guys by yourself, but I'll be right back. I am back. <laughs> all right. Sorry about that. All right. Here we go. Nine West shoes. All right, so some more really cute heels. I love these because um, this really nice lace around here. This is really cute. Really nice heel. This is a size seven medium. And um, the heel looks good, okay? No problem with the heel. Um, the soles look, you know, decent. I mean, it's okay. I mean, obviously, people has walked on these. You know, it's not gonna look perfect. They're they're used, but uh, this is not that bad as the other ones. And this is the inside. So these look decent. Just some cute little Nine West shoes. Uh, this, uh, these obviously have to go in a wash. They're dirty. This is the other one. Okay. All right. These are Lord and Taylor. That's how it looks. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. Cute, shiny guys. <laughs> All right. Um, and let me look at the heel and the sole. Okay. Now this looks really good. Look at that. It only looks like this is really worn. So I like this. Not bad at all, and the heel is good. So 
so that looks good this one looks good too I always look at these with these shoes because I don't want to get something where the heel is all screwed up and then you have all this craziness like on these other shoes that I have here because you know people are not gonna want to really buy it I don't blame them if it's messed up so these are really good so. all right And these, I don't know much about these shoes, um, but I think these are some cute little work shoes. These are some, um, what's it, Rampage? It says Rampage, and the inside, <laughs> Rampage. I can fit these too, these are cute. It's actually a nine medium, so Rampage. You can see the Rampage. Really cute little funky groovy looking flowers. <laughs> and yeah. Oh, you over here. So it's so really good. Not a lot of wear there. And then on the hill, hardly no wear on the hill. That looks good. So I like that. I don't like when things look crazy. Okay, not that. Okay, that's what I look at when I get these shoes. Just make sure it's not too much wear on them. So, guess what, guys? That's it. That's all I got to show you. So, that's it. I am. I'm so sorry if this was a long. Um, I'm so sorry if this is a long video, guys. Um, I I really apologize for that. Um, I just had so much I wanted to show you guys. I didn't want to make so many videos. So, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video. Please, 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 thumbs up if you like this video. Please leave me some feedback in the comment section. What do you like about this video? What brands do you like? What brands don't you like? Tell me what brands you guys actually sell. What brands do you sell? What brands do you enjoy buying? Just let's help each other. This is a great community. Let's try to help each other um, out. <laughs> so just provide feedback to me. I really appreciate it. And also please subscribe guys. If you like my videos, please, please, please subscribe. I really appreciate it. And share this video. Like if you guys really enjoyed it, share it, share it on your social media, you know, websites or whatever, just share it. So I'll definitely be back with more videos. The next video will be with me and my hubby. Um, you know, um, I got a whole bunch of men's clothing, not too much, not like all, you know, probably it's sort of a mini men's haul. So please stay tuned for that one. I really appreciate it hanging out with you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I hope you guys come back and see me again. Okay. Thank you so much. I really enjoy you guys support. I do. It truly means a lot to me. So thanks again. Um, and all as always, continue being blessed. All right, take care, guys. Bye.